I, Sheila Putain, come to you with a review of episode 2 of RuPaul's Drag Race season 3. Sorry about the hair, but as you know, we're getting hammered with some snow here in Iowa. And I just did a weather report and it just messed up all of my hair, blew the damn door wide open. Well, anyways, I just want to say that I did like this episode compared to the first one. I really liked the space, the space movie clip. I thought all the girls actually did, you know, a fairly decent job, except for Mimi was kind of overshot, and I really didn't agree with Rue and the judges' pick on the winning team. I thought the other team actually should have won it. As far as the twins, I actually thought the other set of twins on the team that lost was actually the better set of twins. I really didn't... I mean, Shangela, and then they did a good job, but the other two I thought was a little bit better. I had to take some notes, okay, because I was drinking me some rum and coke while I was watching this show. Um, maybe I got three pages of notes. I don't know. Kurt, you better put I your reading glasses on if you're going to open the library. I know I need my reading glasses, but they went somewhere. Then I'd look like Sarah Palin, and I don't want that. Shangela, Manella was just simply coming up and uh, joking with the girl. Okay, just blow it off. People that irritate you and stuff, just, just blow it off. Don't let it look like you're getting in, under their skin, okay? Uh, just be a little more nice. ESP, the first thing you guys did, you guys all actually looked like you were having fun with each other. And that's the first time I've seen that in this show. I mean, the first episode, you guys are kind of a little all catty and like, the calls are out. Uh, we go to the part where they're picking the teams, okay, and Mimi, one of the reasons why you didn't get picked is because you overestimate yourself. Don't glow, don't overestimate yourself. Girl, if you know that you're the fucking Cracker Jack in the box, let it show. You don't have to tell people, okay? A little, um, I don't know what the word for it is, but, um... I'll think of it, and I'll let you know. Oh. Mimi, Venus is not threatened by you. Because one thing I can tell you is Venus... Girl, Venus got voted off already. Well, I know, but Mimi was saying that Venus was threatened by her when she was sitting at the makeup table. Well, anyways, just don't think you're that good. If you know you're that good, know it and bring it. Just don't brag about it, okay? Mariah, you were just a little bit nervous, and that's why you were messing up your lines. Um, and Mimi, gosh, you're a friend of mine on Facebook, girl, and you're probably going to hate me, but I'm just being completely honest. You just couldn't follow direction. A good actor or actress knows that you just need to follow direction of the director. Listen and execute. Alexis, don't try to be in the light all the time. When you try to be in the light, sometimes being in the light isn't the best thing to do, okay? You were trying to outshine Ch Changela, and I really don't like Changela, but I'll tell you this. Changela does have a little more experience, especially being on the one season already. She knows what's expected of her, and she's going to bring it. Sometimes I shine someone to be a bugger that bites you in the ass. Yara Sophia. Girl, your outfit was sickening. Loved it. Raja, your outfit loved it. And I know on my first review I said that you're kind of a bitch. But you actually showed a softer side to you on this episode. So now you're kind of maybe leaning towards one of Sheila's favorites. But Sheila's not going to say who her favorite is. We're only in the second episode. India, I think you totally killed it with your outfit, girl. I love the boobies. Okay, girl, you're just on fucking fire. Freaking fire. And the one that they sent home today, you deserve to go home. Okay, you're not all that in the bag of chips. I would not actually pay admission to go see you perform, let alone tip you. Okay, overall, I think everybody did a great job on the movie. 
on the movie part. You guys had fun with it. And I just got to say a good shout out here to Delta. Delta, you worked it, bitch. <laughs>